How's it going YouTube? Chris here with My Home Theater. Got a little quick video for you today. Been sitting around thinking uh, about some movies that I wished it would come out on 4K. So before I did this video, I did a quick little search on the, uh, there's a site that I uh, look for upcoming releases on 4K and Blu-ray and it's a very good website. It's blu-ray.com if you hadn't heard of it. Uh, so I did a little quick search just to see if these were coming out and and so far I couldn't find anything on them. Uh, but I really wished that they would come out with a 4K version of these. And and, and not only just for 4K, but an upgraded uh, soundtrack also. Uh, some of these have very good soundtracks as, as at bay. Uh, but it'd be nice to get an Atmos or DTSX soundtrack. So, uh, I mean, I think I, I don't know exactly how many I got here. But just a few movies, uh, more than a few uh, that I would love to see on 4K and an upgraded soundtrack. And the first movie I would love to see is Stargate. This is a fantastic movie. I love this movie. This version is actually the, uh, I don't remember what version it is. I thought it was an anniversary edition, but uh, it has the extended version of the film and stuff. Uh, extended version, theatrical version. It's very good. Uh, it has a DTS HD master audio file on it. It's a very good soundtrack. Uh, but I would love to see this in an Atmos or hear it in an Atmos with a uh, 4K transfer. Uh, this movie, if I ain't mistaken, was like one of the first Laserdiscs. That was back, way back, uh, when Laserdiscs was very, very prominent. Uh, DVD hadn't even came out yet. And if I ain't mistaken, this disc... Uh, was what they call AC3, Dolby Digital, is what they uh, eventually started calling it. It came out on, on Laserdisc, and uh, it was a very good movie back then. It's always been a demo, you know, back in the day, and uh, not so much now, but just a fantastic movie. Uh, James Spader, what a great actor, and uh, I would love to see this in 4K with an Atmos, or a DTSX soundtrack, it would be fantastic. So hopefully, fingers crossed, maybe we'll get that one day. I think Lionsgate has this now, and I, I know they've been doing some catalog titles. Maybe they'll do this one very soon, so let's hope for that. Another movie that I would love to see on 4K transfer, and I would love to see a second part of this movie, is World War Z. <laughs> what a fantastic movie this is. Uh, this one, uh, it does have a 7.1 DTS HD master soundtrack. I'm actually playing it right now. Uh, just letting it play. Uh, this is a good movie. I really like it. Uh, the 7.1 soundtrack is very good. Uh, my pioneer elite, it up, up, up mixes it to the DTS, uh, X neutral, which, you know, also my, Double digital files will a true HD will up up convert to a, a seven a seven point two point four. I get it right in a minute uh, with the Atmos, but you know it's not as good as if they would have an Atmos track or a DTSX track. Uh, but I love this movie. They've been touring around with doing a second part to this. I would really love to see a second part. To this this was a great movie. I'd love to see a 4K transfer. I'd love to see a Atmos DTS soundtrack. So uh, fingers crossed on that. Uh, I think this is Paramount is what I'm saying. And I think they have been doing some catalog titles. Uh, ha ain't many movies coming out here lately. Uh, new releases on Blu-ray and 4K. So hopefully we'll get some catalog titles. I did a quick search. I couldn't find anything. So fingers crossed again on that one. Uh, this is an older movie. I really like this. This is Tron. Legacy, a great movie. And uh, it's a Disney film. I'm trying to remember. Uh, it also has the DTS HD Master 7.1 soundtrack. It's fantastic. The visuals in this movie is great. I really like this film. Love to see a 4K transfer in this uh, with an upgraded soundtrack. And uh, like I say, these, these movies that I've named, they sound good. Uh, on their own and the way they are right now, but you know, it's hard to beat an Atmos or DTS sound, soundtrack, DTS X soundtrack. So I would love to see this. 
Uh, hopefully one day Disney will decide to do that. Uh, another movie that I would love to see. And this movie did not do good at the movie theater, but I, I, I think it's got a good following. Is uh, What's it called? Edge of Tomorrow, Live, Die, Repeat. Uh, this movie, I think it bombed at the theater, but I love it. I love this movie. And when you put this thing in and the movie starts, you better not have your subwoofers cranked up. It might blow them out, bottoming out. This thing has got a low frequency tone. Like, it's unbelievable. And a lot of people uh, always use that, use it to test your woofers. It, it, it'll, it'll put them through the test. But even the movie itself is great. I really like it. Uh, trying to remember what the soundtrack is. It has the DTS HD Master. Not not confident if it's uh, 7.1 or 5.1, but well, regardless, uh, most receivers are up converted to a 7.1 or 7.2.4, whatever. But great movie. Love this movie. Uh, love to see them go ahead and do a transfer to that. Hopefully they will. Uh, I'm trying to remember who, who does this movie not sure right now oh warner brothers so maybe maybe they'll go ahead and do it uh i was excited about these next uh few movies here uh i did a quick search no release date but it was on there that they're doing a 4k transfer so the first one is all three films the lord of the rings oh my goodness i love these films saw them at the movies just absolutely Peter Jackson's, he, he, he just did an amazing job bringing these movies to life, to the movies, uh, from the books. And it's hard to, hard to beat these films. I, I really like them. Uh, so there is a 4K transfer in the works. Uh, so I'm not sure which soundtrack I would really like to have. Uh, it's it's hard to say. It would be nice to have a maybe a DTSX IMAX enhanced version, or, or maybe just at most. It would be nice to have a movie that you can actually have DTSX and an Atmos track, and you can pick which one you want to uh, do. Uh, there is a way to to do a test on that. Uh, I think I watched a video. Somebody did. I can't remember who it was. He did. Uh, Disney Plus streaming on a movie and it was an Atmos and then you got the film, the media was in DTSX IMAX Enhanced. So that was a really good way and uh, he tested and I think he, he liked that IMAX Enhanced was actually better than the Atmos. But there again, you're talking about streaming Atmos and then a physical media, which to me, media is going to be better. I'm just I'm just saying. I like physical media better. So anyway, I was excited about that. No release date, but is it is in the works. And the next, it's really like, again, that was three films. This is three films. All three of the Hobbits. Would love to see these in 4K with maybe a DTSX or something transfer. But there again, they're doing the Lord of the Rings. I found out that they are in the works. They had it listed that it was, it was coming but no release date. So that is good to know. Uh, these are, again, Peter Jackson did a phenomenal job with the Hobbits. He did a phenomenal job with the uh, Lord of the Rings. And uh, man, I'm telling you, I would love to see these all in just like a big box set in 4K, Atmos, DTSX. It don't matter which one they do, just as long as they redo the soundtrack when they redo the movie. I know a lot of movies excuse me, a lot of movies, they'll do a, a 4K transfer, <coughs> excuse me, 4K transfer and no upgraded soundtrack. So that is, to me, a kind of a waste if they're going to take the time to redo the movie. Hey, guys, do the soundtrack, okay? So that's my thoughts. That's my few movies there that I would love to see in a 4K. Uh, if you like this kind of content, hey, like, subscribe, share. Uh, drop down in the comment below. Let me know your thoughts on what you'd like to see on a uh, 4K transfer with an upgraded soundtrack. Love to hear from you. And I uh, hope everybody has a good week. We'll see you again real soon.